Well, it's week two of high school football, and our high five sports game of the week <laughs> takes us to Coweta County. It's a showdown between the Noonan Cougars and East Coweta Indians. Fox 5 Sports' Kelly Price joins us live with the big matchup at Garland Shoemaker Stadium. Kelly? Yeah, guys, this one a big rivalry that's played a lot earlier than the season than it used to be. Afternoon and dropped down to Class 6A from 7A. But now we've got this lovely trophy here, the Brantley Knot Jug. This is something they've been playing for since 2013. Legend has it that this thing was left on the field one year and both teams could not decide whose it was. So they said, hey, let's just start playing for this every year. So they've been playing for this every year since 2013. You can see that the last couple of years, East Coweta has kind of dominated this one. They're going for a fourth straight win in this rivalry today. We'll bring in head coach John Small. Thanks so much for being here, coach. Yeah, um, both teams lost last week, so pretty hungry. I mean, how do you kind of feel going into this one? Yeah, it's kind of unique because it's game two, and I told the kids earlier today, I said, I don't know if there's ever time that both teams were starting out 0-1 and, and playing each other. <laughs> but, you know, we last week was a tough week for us. We turned the ball over a lot. But uh, when you lose, you find a lot about the character of your football team. And I was – Oh, sorry. Go yeah, ahead. And, and so we're looking forward to these guys bouncing back and having some resolve about them and taking some ownership and learning from it. And no better way to, to do that against your rival. You know, to, it, the kids are up. They're excited. It's a big ball game. And so we got their attention pretty quick after the game, knowing who we play next. Yeah, I got those competitive juices flowing for sure. And I was going to ask about the turnovers. How do you kind of get to short, that short up this week? Well, don't throw it to them and don't drop it. <laughs> you know, you've got to secure the football, make the right decisions, run the right routes, and everybody's got to do their job. You know, it's not a one-man show. Everybody's got to do their part and contribute. We all contributed to every bad thing that happened, and we all got to contribute to a lot of the great things that could happen. A lot of learning comes between that week one and week two. What did you learn about these guys? Well, I learned that, you know, they, they do have some character, and I was proud of our kids Monday that they called a team meeting and they took ownership for their play. And, and nobody else that didn't point the finger. I was really proud of that from them. And, you know, Stars Mill has a great team, and, and, and they beat us, and we got to take that and learn from it. And I told the kids, you know, you make the most improvement from week one to week two in a season at every level. And so we're going to find out tonight how much improvement we made. For sure, and it should be a really awesome game of the week here. Big rivalry game. You can already see some fans kind of in the stands for this 8 o'clock kickoff, guys. Perfect night for it, too. Kelly, thanks so much. And you can catch Kelly Price again later tonight. Be sure to tune in to High Five Sports at 11 o'clock.